Is tonight's top story. The future career of a Grand Rapids police captain is in question. It's coming after a civilian appeals board ruled that actions from the officer constitute racial profiling. 13 on your side's Amr Boss joins us now with more. Amr. Yeah, Captain Kurt Vanderkoy contacted ICE after a man was arrested for starting a small fire at a hospital. Now it's up to the city manager to decide if those actions could cost Vanderkoy his job. Uh, Captain Vanderkoy has been a dedicated police officer for 39 years. He saved lives and he made a mistake. That mistake came in November when this man, Hilmar Ramos Gomez, broke into the helipad at Spectrum Hospital and started a small fire. Vanderkoy saw Ramos Gomez's picture on the news and called ICE. I felt like he should have been more diligent with speaking with officers who actually interviewed Ramos Gomez that day. You know, because he could have find out, found out at that point in time that, that he was a U.S. citizen and he was a veteran. Once ICE got involved, they detained the former Marine for three days and were ready to deport. Adding to Vanderkoy's problems were emails that surfaced showing he used the word loco in referring to the situation. Here we have a citizen review board, independent citizens looking impartially at this evidence and saying, no, this was racial profiling, pure and simple. GRPD's internal investigation exonerated Vanderkoy of any wrongdoing, but the city's citizen appeals board reversed the decision with a 6-2 to two vote. It's only the third time the board has reversed a decision in more than 20 years. And I'm not saying I don't respect your opinions and what you do. It's got nothing to do with that. I just believe that law enforcement gets such a bad rap in this city. I now the final decision is now up to Grand Rapids City Manager Mark Washington. He is expected to make a ruling in the coming weeks. To